This is Handelsblatt Global Edition in Berlin. These are today's top stories. Europeans resume negotiations on refugee sharing. European leaders are meeting today in Brussels to resume stalled talks on a plan to share the costs of housing millions of refugees flooding into the continent. Most of the 28 EU countries, except for Germany and Sweden, have so far refused to accept significant numbers of migrants. Negotiators at the two-day gathering will also debate how to finance a 3 billion euro EU aid package to Turkey, whose Prime Minister is attending the meeting. German lawmakers say Secret Service overstepped authority. The head of a German parliamentary panel looking into the country's Secret Service says the agency overstepped its authority by spying on governments and individuals in the EU and NATO. Committee chairman André Hahn told news agency DPA that German Secret Service agents improperly spied on German citizens as well as other EU residents. The German parliament may push next year to impose new legal restrictions on the agency. Boardroom battle rocks Rocket Internet. German startup incubator and high-tech darling Rocket Internet is being rolled by a high-level board fight that has led to the ouster of one of its biggest investors. The Berlin-based company, which brought online shoe retailer Zalando public and owned stakes in food delivery companies such as Food Panda, said Wednesday it is parting ways with its chairman, Lorenzo Grabau. Mr. Grabau heads Kinovic, a Swedish venture capital company that has 14% stake in Rocket. Sources told Handelsblatt that Grabau and Rocket's founding Samba Brothers had a falling out. The startup shares have fallen by a third since its public listing in 2014. German birth rate reaches post-reunification high. More babies are being born in Germany than at any time since reunification, according to a new government report. The average number of children born to a German woman rose to 1.47 in 2014, from 1.42 the year before. Experts attribute the rise to the country's growing economy and increasing migration from countries where women have more children. 